Welcome back! I'm Crystal, this is Crystal Cluster Gaming, and we are in the World of Warcraft! We're continuing with our Battle for Azeroth portion- Battle for Azeroth of our- portion of our leveling series, where I level from 1 to 60, and I talk about what I can remember and what I can't remember from Classic, that way when it comes live here in just over a month, we're gonna do it all over again, and we're gonna find out how much I get wrong. Which, if you guys have been paying attention, kind of a lot. Uh, if this is your first video, um, the playlist is down in the description for your viewer, um, viewing pleasure and comfort. It's also in the end cards at the end of every single video. Uh, watch those first if you want. Uh, I always recommend doing things in order because there might be something you miss. We are level 39 in episode 20 this is the 20th episode of our playlist part of me is very sorry for that <laughs> um we will hit 40 which we will be getting our new mount um we did pick up a quest accidentally for our we have to eliminate the outcast travel to the ruins of or a bronze to deal with zanzeel you are to kill him you rode the bat, you found out what happened. Please do this thing for me. You should use this fetish, it only works on the Stranglethorn, but it will transport you back to me swiftly. Okay, so we picked up that quest, we still have a couple more to pick up from this gnome. So, what do you say we get started? Need assistance? Results, inconclusive. In our last video, he was playing with Zanziel's elixirs and it kind of threw him on his butt, which was funny. Uh, also, we spied on Zanziel the Outcast to find out he's we're he is working for the forces of ZG Zulgarab. So we are going to deal with him as I just stated. Um, I did what I could. I had the right potions. I had the right recipes, but sources of this sample elude me. It's tens of thousands of years old, but we've shown it is not of Titan origin. And it's not Serenite. I can tell you just by looking at it. So what in Bronze name is it? You can tell him I tried, okay? Alright. So we opened the box, couldn't figure out what the hell it was. Uh, did you see that explosion I made? I must have flown ten inches off the ground! I've got to get Zanziel to Zanziel's recipe so I can find out why it did that! One of Zanziel's flunkies in the ruins of Aboraz must have it on him. Head east, up to the coast of the Cape, and snatch it for me. And we get a pair of pants. Okay. Be seeing you. We also helped this cute little girl uh, do some, take some stuff for the Naga, which was a very adorable quest. What can I do for you? All right. I saw smoke. Is everything okay? I knew that alchemist was all talk. Well, thank you for your help. We'll have no idea what this artifact is. It's old, it's older than dirt, but it's not Titan. I am completely dumbstruck. Um, Erwin Batum Flask in Booty Bay is my direct superior. Uh, our, our next step should be to inform her of this find. Can you do that? Alright, we do have a quest to go to the uh, pirate, uh, pirate port of Booty Bay. But first... Let's deal with these guys, shall we? That's okay, though. Oh, hey, Zanziel. Or Zanziel Witch Doctor. Thought he was Zanziel for a second. But they were just standing on each other. I mean, what they do in the jungle is their own business, I'm just saying. Oh yeah, melee hunter for the win, eh? Alright, let's go. I don't like how these um, undead dudes sit on top where I'm not looking and then jump down and then just kind of swarm my butt. I know that's the whole point, but I don't like it.
It appears you're too late. Zenziel has left. It looks like the portal ooh, is open to ZG. It's, uh, it's a very dangerous place, but Milwaukee has entrusted this task to you. The portal lies in front of you. What are you going to do? We're actually not going to do anything just yet because we need the formula. So that, that portal is not going to close. So we're going to try to take out a couple more with doctors first real quick. And then we'll go risk our, risk our life. All right, so we got the formula, so let's go jump through a portal. What's the worst that could happen? Famous last words. Skabushki. Our cannonball. You get the idea. All right. You have arrived safely within Zulgarub, the ruined capital of the once mighty Gorabashi tribe. Head... Ahead of you looms the ramp to one of the city's many terraces. A bat-shaped totem ahead of you indicates that this was the domain of the High Priestess Jekyllik. No. Uh, she was one of Hakar's worshipping priests that Zanzil is planning to resurrect. Perhaps if you hurry, you could stop the ritual. Alright. Meowser, we have a mission. Forward! been so very long since I've been in ZG further than the first boss because mount farming is fun. Alright, let's do this shit. What are you doing here? Don't matter. I'm going to resurrect her before you have the chance to interfere. Does he not notice that we're already interfering? Just a little? See? I've had enough of this. It's time to take a break. Alright. Destroy her body then. I'll admit, I'm not 100% sure what to do, but this is what we're doing. He's back! We must stop him! We must stop him! I don't have a Enough of this, time to take a break. Meowster and I will continue this then. We must make sure this troll never arises. I believe one of the things I remember from Classic is the regeneration for Zanziel's forces. I believe they like regenerated a lot of health and I'm trying to remember. We're gonna have to definitely, I can't wait to go back and find out because memory sucks as we're figuring out. Uh-oh. Jindo is not gonna be happy about this. It's time to get out of here! <clears throat> As you can see, there's nothing I can do. He's a boss anyway, I'm pretty sure. You have succeeded in preventing Zenzo from, re from resurrecting High Priestess Jack. Without the priest, Jindo is weakened. I clicked that too quick. Pass through the portal! Uh, is once again, we have to follow him. Alright, through the portal. Alright, where are we? We are still in ZG. You find yourself deeper within ZG. The snake statues indicate that this is where Varoxis is. Alright. We must stop Varoxis. We must stop High Priestess Varoxis. She is yet to be resurrected. Back for more, huh? Too bad, because I've got Stronger Potion mixed up. This time, Varoxis will live. I need a target. Uh, Zanziel is the winner this time. We must celebrate. Or look who has come to celebrate. Finish Varoxis and we'll talk about your failures. Okay, so yeah, we were supposed to be overwhelmed. There was nothing you can do. And you, you have interfered with my plans for the last time. Hakar has grown impatient and so do I. You have slain Jek. But you will not z leave ZG alive. Prepare to die. Quick, get on the boat! So we got on the boat. <laughs> Meh! Whew. We got out. We got it alive. This is fascinating! Just think of all the applications! Thanks again! Remember, you ever need anything mixed for you, and I mean anything, all you have to do is flap. Ask the flaps. Uh huh. So we got a pair of pants from that quest. 
And we're gonna go talk to uh, the Zandalari here. Best goods in the Empire. I ask, right I ask you to slay Zanza the Outcast, a lowly her hermetic exile of the Gurabashi. And what do you do? You dash headfirst into the Gurabashi capital and eliminate one of their priests. Very nearly two of them. Only words can, only one word can suffice uh, to explain such a rash and foolhardy endeavor. endeavor. Heroism. Gendo, Gendo the Hexer will walk within Zulgarab's walls, but he has lost one of his legs when you crushed Jek. Today, the battle is ours. Come again. All right, we got another purple. We now have a purple pair of boots. And we are done here in the Explorers League, which is cool. Oh, now we get to go, we get to run down to Booty Bay. So I will meet you guys in the pirate port of Booty Bay. Yeah, I, th I think that once again we are going to sidestep because we found that bottle in our last episode. That somebody needs our help. So, as the good heroic types, we are going to cross this lake. And then we are going to save this person. So, stand by. Welcome to Jagoro Isle. It rain and it's pouring and the old man Shia be snoring. So we're gonna find some panthers out here but most importantly we're going to find out what's going on. Hello! Princess Pooba. This is your bottle, huh? All right, these vicious jungle cats have been circling me f for some time now. I have watched them closely as I can, but they seem just to disappear into the grass. How they snarl and they hiss. Don't get me wrong, I still want you to rescue me, but first clear out some of the kitties. So let's kill, take care of some of the kitties. One. That's two. Now, if I remember correctly, in Classic, this area was actually level 50. In now, yeah, another thing in Classic, um, the s professions. You had to upgrade at like 75, 150, 225, and then at 300, or you were stuck there. In current, wow, it just does it for you. So now we're at 227. All right. So we took care of the kitty cats for our friend here and found another cat. It's like, sheesh. What All right. You? So it's about time you returned. I was thinking that you were getting eaten. Uh, a cat eating a princess, wouldn't that be a fancy feast? Uh, grubby little pause. I understand you're anxious to rescue me, but it is not time right yet. First, I'm going to need my things. <coughs> the gorillas and the monkeys on the other side of the island have taken most of my possessions. Can you go take care of them? Man, she's a pain. This princess might not actually be worth the things that she is worth, my friends. We got her diary. Then we're gonna go over here, see if we can get her something else. We got her tiara. Man, like, who is this princess too, man? Like, I don't know. Is she, like, somebody's daughter from somewhere else? Because I don't think she's anyone important. And we're now level 40, guys! We're level 40, we're level 40. That means it is time for us to get our journeyman riding skill. Because in this expansion, it's level 40. Next expansion, or in classic, it's level 60. So we can get it now. We're just going to finish up here. And we're going to go do just that. So we can ride faster. I'm way too excited about an epic mount. 
Oh, and it looks like we also have another talent. Let's go take a look. It's a PvP talent that nobody cares about. So we're just gonna put it there. I don't actually care about the PvP talents. I don't PvP. So don't go telling me, hey, that's the wrong talent because I legitimately don't care. Okay. So let's go return this to the princess, uh, the princess, uh, Miss, Miss Princess Ungrateful. Here we come all the way over here to rescue her butt and she's all like, nah. Turns out she actually wants to be living with the monkeys and the cats, let me tell you. That's what she wants. Okay. Peace, friend. I shudder to think what Mulk plans to do with me. So, surveys her belongings. Great. I think I'm ready to be rescued now. Uh, now I put my faith into your hands to help free me. The great Sky Main King, Mulka is my captor. He commands the beasts on the island and keeps me here against Slay the monkey, get the shackle key. It has now stopped raining. I believe there was a, it was a pet you could only get if it was raining. Which we saw the baby ape. Yep, I don't see it anymore. But uh, we're not doing pet battles here because pet battles is not in classic. That and I don't particularly feel like doing pet battles. That's the most important part. I don't do. I don't like doing pet battles. Ah, we're getting barrels thrown at us. Let's throw in some cooldowns to make fast work of this monkey. I know we do have another hunter helping us out, which is also cool. There we go. Monkey's down. Shackle key obtained. You wish to speak? Okay. Uh, you have saved me from a, the greatest a great dishonor. It was within my power. I would offer you a place among my tribe, but for now, all I can offer you is this token of courage and nobility. I got a bracelet. You barely need. Thank you again. May the winds always be at your back during your travels. Okay, so that quest is done. So let's head to Booty Bay. We're gonna take a break from questing in Stranglethorn Vale to go get our mount. All right, welcome to Booty Bay. The wind-swept, water-warped pirate town that the uh, Booty Bay uh, goblins are, are here. Um, this place used to look a lot nicer, but it got hit with a giant tidal wave, so it no longer looks like that. So let's pick up a few quests. Won't take us that long. I used to sail a ship from here all the way to Ratchet in Kalimdor. I was a successful captain with a, I was a successful captain with a sterling rep, sterling reputation until those cursed sea giants ruined me. They smashed my ship, they killed my crew, and they set me on a lifeboat to Booty Bay. I will not test I will not rest until the corpses pepper the ocean floor. One of those giants, Gorlash, we passed him a couple seconds ago, stole my captain's chest. Okay. So uh, that quest did exist in classic. Hello. I'm not sure as to what uh, what variant. Uh, called to Kalimdor, I've been sent by the good people of Theramore to find loyal members of the Alliance who are willing to help Lady Jaina and her problems in Duskwilla Marsh. If you you weren't really here working for goblins, were you? The path back to Duskwilla is through Ratchet, so I can take the ship and head to Ratchet if I want. But we're not finished in Stranglethorn Vale, and I have stated in previous videos that I prefer to continue until the story is over. I use money, friend! Bloodsail Buccaneers, uh, you sure seem eager to work, matey. Not sure why some land-loving night elf hunter is going to help us and Blackwater Raiders. We um, but I'm not going to turn you away. We've made Booty Bay our happy home away from the high seas, but the blood sail are making our lives miserable. Can you talk to, uh, can you, can you take care of some things for me? Not a problem, not a problem. There's a lot of quests in Booty Bay that we get to pick up. Sick. So very sick. I've contracted Stranglethorn fever. 
Technically, it's Cape of Stranglethorn Fever. Deathly virus. Only the cure is Mamak the Savage, an elusive wild beast. Uh, seek out witch doctor Ambagwa to have him summon the monkey. That'll be a quest we can definitely do. There's so many. Okay, over here. Hey there. Uh, five misfailed giblets from the elder, the big elder gorillas. Um, first, there. Uh, one of the things I can't stand is people who don't pay their gambling debts. Uh, go out of town and hunt the elders. Find a nice selection and then give them to Shaky. Scare do. the crap out of them. Yeah, I, I am kind of skipping some of this quest text because it is kind of lengthy. Uh, so sorry. All right, so I have a quest to turn in there. Ah! Okay, fine. Bro, we'll go turn to this quest first. Greetings! All right, yes, Night Elf, I'm quite busy. Fascinating! I'm ready, then. All right. Is she gonna do anything? Nope. That was the end of that quest. So now we're gonna go... head up here. Booty Bay has always been the source of crazy adventure. We got leatherworking stuff here. We got professiony stuff. It's kind of fun. Uh, War Mage. Uh, this War Mage buddy it wants to send us to the Western Plaguelands. Uh, the Western Plaguelands is definitely a place that I am interested in doing because I always love doing the Western Plaguelands quests. Um, so we might, we might not. So we're just going to accept that quest. We'll talk to him whenever we decide to head to another area. But for now, we are going to head to Stormwind real fast. Alrighty then. We have arrived back in Booty Bay, folks. Um, we now have our mount. We are using the swift a mist saber. I think it looks pretty cool. We had to sell pretty much everything we own in order to get it because we didn't. We were very close to not having enough money. Not that that's a big deal, because I mean we were fine. We we're only a couple gold short. So, but this is our last mount. This is this is this is it. This will be probably the same mount we use in level um, in classic. I'm gonna we'll see if I remember that far. Um. So, hmm. yeah, we can now run super fast. Uh, in classic, um, the riding skill scales. So when I say that, what I mean to say is that I could have technically continued to use that cat, the one that I was using. But in classic, um, I, I think I've said this in a previous video, that you very much can't. You could only use the one mount for the one type of riding skill. There were no scaling mounts. I was hoping I could ride on that net. So this is our new situation. These are our new friends. This is new mounts. Um, that's all we did. We're now level 40. So I think right now, considering how many quests we have been given to this beautiful southern continent, we are going to call it here here for now so if you like this video do the thing subscribe ring that bell comment down below especially if you want me to do dungeons or do professions um all that good stuff i want to hear from you guys but until then we will see you guys in the next video have a good one